All right, so let's go from here and, and actually kind of uh, transfer over to how this relates to what we're doing today, okay? And the first part of it is that we're actually going to do kind of a review uh, of how simplifying expressions. I know that, Abby, you haven't done it before, and Corish, you haven't used algebra tiles a lot either, have you? Okay, so the good thing about it, I got everybody paired up with, with actually people that have done it before, so that way they can help you uh, figure it out, okay? The first thing is, somebody explain to me what you do with algebra tiles. Pull out algebra tile and tell me what they are and what they represent. Somebody raise your hand, let me know. This is one. Hold on. Good, 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 good. Go ahead. So this is y, and this is y squared, and it just fits all around the edges, so it makes y squared. Okay, so basically she said it y on one side and y on the other side. So you have this, this is y here, this is y here, okay? So basically, you know how we've been finding the area? How you find the area? 50 times. Huh? Multiply the sides. Multiply the sides, right, good. So left times width, right? So then basically on this is y times y. <laughs> y times y is y squared. Yep. Okay, so that's why this tile piece is y squared. Another piece, uh, Anthony, what do you have there? X. X, hold it up and see what you got. One's, one's positive, one's negative. Okay, which one's positive, one's not negative? Blue's positive, red's negative. Okay. All right, good, thank you. And we got another one over Lamarius. What do you have? A Y squared. We already did the Y squared. Um, you pick back off, that's what, that's what. X, Y? Oh, I, did you do Y squared? Yes. yes. Oh, X, Y did. There we go, all right, good, good. Flip it around, let's see the colors. Green, this Y, I mean X, Y. Now why is it X, Y? Why is it X, Y? <laughs> um, I'm just, I don't know, I forgot. Think it looked it. like, um, like, mm. why is it? Why is this x y? Why, why? Why? How do we get y squared here? Um, you multiply to two y's. Multiply the two y's. What's the the two what? Uh, oh, y's. The two sides. Yeah, okay. two sides. Okay, all right. So then, what we do? What is this here then? What's this telling you? Same thing um, as the uh, one we um, multiply the sides. Good. X and Y. X and Y, good. So that would, that would mean that what? What would be the side lengths of this? X and Y. X and Y, X and Y, good. So then show me the X tile again, Anthony. Okay, wow. So what, what did you notice? One side, um, oh. it, fits, it fits on one side. Okay. Pretty much two sides. Does it fit on the top? No. No, why? Because... This side's Y, and this one's shorter. Okay, that one's shorter. The shorter one is the X, the longer one is the, the Y. Like, like what Lamarius has, exactly. Okay, he, he did the Y side. Okay, so we got this one figured out, we got this one. We got another piece, a couple of pieces that we haven't figured out. Okay. Yeah, we haven't discovered. Okay, yes, what is that one? Uh, X squared. How is it X squared? Um, because you uh, multiply into two sides. The two sides. Corice, do you see what he's saying? Okay. Cody, you got it? Abby, do you understand that? Yes. I like that you're discovering your pieces there, looking through them there. That's fine. Um, and then you have the, well, we did X, X, Y, Y, X squared, I mean, Y squared, excuse me. And what about these, the small ones? Five Wait, what do you think? You said five you units? Know. Five units? Why is it five units? Five of these on one of them. Yes, and Josh is, is point, pointing out that normally we don't use the five units. Uh, we like we know we don't say never, but you know we <laughs> we may, <laughs> but we haven't been using them. You're right. Um, but and the reason why is that we like to use the, the single unit tiles instead of using another one. Okay. All right. Yes, Anthony, you got a question? Is this why like we don't use these because they don't fit on these? Like it doesn't go with these. No, the reason why we don't use it because you know how we, you'll see when we start simplifying and, and splitting, you can't break those pieces apart. Mm -hmm. So if you had to subtract from that five unit tile. You have to take all of it away. You have to take all of it away and then bring out, so you're gonna have to bring out five unit tiles anyway, or bring out individual unit tiles anyway. Excuse me, this doesn't fit on any of them. It doesn't fit on any of them, that's a good observation. Excellent. But, so you're picking up on it quick, Abby, good, good, good. But, but they fit inside of them. Inside? Mm -hmm. What? 
like, uh, um, elaborate on that a little bit. I guess. Oh wait, I know how. Like, he's saying, but he's saying that you can put, put the piece on the inside, but that that's true. But we don't know what y squared is worth. Right, so that's a good observation. That's good. All right, so let's move on to now. How do we use using the the mats? These right here are equation mats. Okay, go ahead, explain it. I'm sorry. The equation maps are like these are like the positives, like like the plus signs, and these are negatives. And then this is like the divide line, right? And this is equal. Like if like right here, that's equal. You're right. So, did you get that, Abby? You get that, Cole Reese? Go ahead. Well, so, what's in the middle? The equal. Equal, good, good. And then the positive, and we have the negative side, right? All right, good, good. So, tell me, period, since you have a, a map right there, if I put this equation down, okay? I'll make it easy for you. First one x squared plus y squared plus. 3x squared. Remember, do I have an equal sign here? No. So am I asking you to solve? Simplify. Simplify. Just simplifying. Good. So all we're doing is simplifying. Everybody look at, look at uh, uh, Amber here. Do, you, like, do these go on this side? Because I get that mixed up sometimes. Good question. She asking this that, it, that she change size. Now tell me, you told me what that was that middle mean? Equal. Equal. Oh, so okay. This all. There you go. Yeah, is that? All right. So what? So because there's because you have one x squared. Here's the one, and it's all positive. So so everybody go ahead and do it at your table. Work out the same one. Do this one on the board. Oh, just time out just for a second. Give them a chance to catch up with you. Everybody get their towels out, Cole Reese? Let Cole Reese have some of the towels too, that way he can be an active participant. Come on. Everybody's, every, every group's gonna have a chance to, to explain. <clears throat> Are we good? All right, go ahead, Amber. Oh. <laughs> um, uh -huh. So this one x squared, so here's your one. Then plus y squared, so here's this. OK. And then your 3x squared, so I have 3 right there. Oh, but none of them are negative, so, so I leave them on the color, and I leave them on the positive side. OK, so now <clears throat> I want you to, on your expression mat, <clears throat> excuse me, on your expression, I want you to write what the new expression is. New expression. Oh, okay. <clears throat> On your expression mat, I want you to write what your new expression is. Write how you, what you mean. Four. So when you're simplifying this box, it, box. just write. Write down. You're going to do written expression. You're going to write what this new expression. When you simplify it, you, you rewrite it. What do you write down here? <coughs> Josh, help you out your partner. We got it. Cause I think I think I understand it now. Okay. Go ahead, Abby. You said you got it. Okay. So you have this one, and then it, which one's positive and which one's negative? Well, <clears throat> good question. Which one did you tell Anthony was positive or negative? How do you? Oh, how, this how do you is it out? positive. Why is it positive? Because it's purple. Because it's purple, and what's the, the negative? Red. red. Red, just think about it. hot, negative, no, you know, okay. bad, whatever, okay? <laughs> and then you have four. So two X and another two X. No, wait. No, one X and one X is two X. No, okay. What? You can keep, keep talking. And then three X. I don't, I don't think that's right. That's okay. not how she explained it. Okay, all right. Somebody help her out. Uh, how about Kiana? Four X. I mean four. Oh. How many like four X's do you have? Squares. Four. 
Four X squares. Squares. Okay. So she said four X squared plus Y squared. Okay, so then remember, we went back and we said, <clears throat> just a quick review, everybody look up, that if you want to go ahead and circle if you need to, or if you have the towels, you bring the like terms together, right? Remember, simplifying, we want to bring like terms together. So we can circle the X squared, circle the 3X squared, and say, well, these two come together, right? Right? Yes, sir. X squared plus 3X squared is how much? Four. Four. Come on. X squared. Four X squared. There we go. Four X squared. Do we have anything else to go with the Y squared? No. No. Plus Y squared. All we did is simplify. That's simple, okay? All right? Good thing about it. I gave you, paper, I gave you some paper towel. You can wipe off your mat. Let's get started.